such a nice weather, windy, uh, not too hot and not too cold. It's not cold at all actually, it's already summer and I'm currently in Fukuroi city in Kasuisai temple. I came to see the temple and also the garden, lily garden, maybe lily park, flower park. It's not my first time in Kasuisai temple but it will be my first time making video so let's check it together. Before I introduce you to Kasuisai Temple, let me tell you briefly what I came across near the temple. These wind bells are called furin in Japanese. Fu means wind and rin means bell. It's one of Japan's most characteristic symbols of the summer and they are usually hanging outside many houses, shops and temples. The beauty and the sound of the furin are not the only reason for its immense popularity in Japan. The bells will only produce sound once the wind moves the paper attached to it. And the sound is strongly associated with a nice summer breeze. Some research even claims that the body feels cooler after listening to a wind bell. Being there and experiencing it, I came to conclusion that natural sounds of wind bells are relaxing and can be healing as they match the rhythm of life and nature. Kasuisai Temple is, as I said, located in Fukuroi city in Shizuoka prefecture. It's one of the oldest temples in Japan. Oh my god, Sunny. It's my third time coming to this place, but it's always enjoyable. When you enter the yard of the temple, you immediately feel the peaceful atmosphere as well as enjoyable view of both temple and beautiful trees around it. This time I didn't enter the temple as I had a chance to see what is inside several times already. And now I'm using the videos I took in the past. Kasuisai temple is must visit place especially during Hinamatsuri period. Hinamatsuri is Japanese doll festival. You'll have a chance to see all the rooms of the temple decorated with beautiful traditional dolls. Decorations are not limited to only dolls, you can also find the astonishing pictures, gorgeous flowers, different souvenirs, handmade decorations and many more. I highly recommend you to visit this place when you come to Shizuoka.
I didn't realize how time passed so quickly when I was enjoying the sound of wind bells and I was late for Lily Park. Apparently it's open only until 5 pm. But I could enjoy seeing flowers outside the park. Sadly, most places in Japan close early. But my sadness disappeared as soon as I saw this amazing ice cream shop. This place is very famous in Fukuoka city and no one leaves the Kasuisai temple without eating this ice cream. The taste of it was out of this world, so yummy, I'm not even exaggerating. I hope you enjoyed the video about Kasuisai Temple. It was so peaceful today, maybe because it's Friday, it's working day. That's why there were not a lot of people. But so unfortunate that I was late for Lily Garden. Next time I'll try to be on time and make another beautiful video about Lily Garden. And thank you for watching this video. Goodbye!